first year at university was really not as um, horrific as I thought it was going to be coming in from high school. <laughs> They're very careful to ease you into studying law. You do a foundations course where they teach you how to read cases and read legislation and give you a background with lots of um, basic legal concepts. Law classes are a lot more like high school classes than most of the other courses because the class sizes are fairly small. It's about 30 people in a class. You really start to recognise your students and the people that you go through law with and that can be really helpful just on a social level to, under, to get to know the people you're with and um, that are going through the same thing as you but also to uh, network and know the people that will be you'll be working with eventually. The lecturer will try and stimulate class discussion so it's really about exchanging views on a particular issue rather than kind of sitting there silently and, and listening to a lecturer. All the law school exams are open book so it's not actually about memorizing anything you've really got to learn the skills of how to take the knowledge and take the rules that you learn and apply them. Mooting is like a legal debate. Uh, you get a question that's either based on a real case or a hypothetical one. There's two different teams. You get to prepare real arguments and then present them before a judge. It's essentially a mock trial but in an appeal court. And you have to prepare with a partner and talk in special legal language. There's a moot court at the law school which is incredible. I found that it was really exceptionally great for getting to know course content before your peers because you're mooting subjects that you're still studying. I wouldn't be too scared about taking up law because you've heard that the workload is, is too much. I think it's very, very manageable um, and, and the type of people that you know do well are those people which um, are able to balance their workload um, with other opportunities and interests that they have. Doing an interview at the Kingsford Legal Centre is actually a really good experience. It lets you put some of the skills that you learn in class into practice. And the Kingsford Legal Centre does amazing work and it's really good that um, the university does send uh, students down there. Basically they put you in the Legal Centre and um, get you to assist the lawyers that work there and just to kind of see what a legal centre is like and how to deal with clients and again putting into practice everything that they teach you in the classes here. And they have an excellent exchange program. You can pretty much go anywhere you want all around the world. It's a fantastic way to build up contacts and make friends in other countries. I went on exchange um, last year. I went to Nottingham and I did a year of law subjects over there. I went to Lund University in Sweden. Um, I've studied in New York at the New York University um, and I've also studied at Harvard University. This summer I'm planning to go to Indonesia for six weeks to volunteer with a legal aid group over there. And through my law degree I've been involved with the International Commission of Jurists where we've travelled to Bougainville on numerous occasions upon the request of the President. I've also worked for the Human Rights and Equal Opportunities um, Commission in Australia through an internship. I, I've done some, um, some internships for some, some major politicians um, as, as part-time work and I've also um, you know, helped write publications um, in economics and finance. So I think one of the great things about coming to the Faculty of Law is that you really do have the flexibility to balance your academic studies with the ability to pursue opportunities outside academia, outside um, the university itself.